Welcome back to Jay's Eerie. Um, last time I interrupted before we could be attacked by Trafer, I think. So let's get right into this. My pathetic lack of defense had been punished by a blow to the solar plexus. The urge to vomit assailed me as I was sent flying backwards, and though I managed to land safely, I was now down on my knees, unable to get back up. Sate, you are a little bit more than a Fuji-san. You are a little bit more than a Fuji-san. I'm sorry. Well, it appears I finally managed to quiet you, Mr. Fuji. I doubt you will be able to move right away, so be a good boy and listen. Gekko. Your eminence. Ah, Anata mo desu yo, Leon Haruto. So, muda ni kyoshiku suru hitsuyo wa nai. The same applies to you, Leon Hart. There is hardly a need to be so tense. One second. Um. <clears throat> I needed something to drink. Oh, I thought I was going to drink it. The one who issued the command takes responsibility. This is by no means your fault. What? Why? Uh, 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 is Ren at fault here? The one at fault are me and the boy. You need not worry. <laughs> Do you perchance object? No, my apologies. Sakurai hanged her head, uttering the phrase without the slightest hint of emotion before taking a step back to silently stand at attention. Their hierarchical hi hi hierarchical Whatever and relationship seemed quite evident. Sakurai was treating Father Trifa as a superior. Duh! You've mm, witnessed firsthand the difference in strength and presence. So, um, I don't know. Normally, in these kinds of organizations, the strongest is normally a higher position. So, yeah. As for him, ah, this car, so you shakshi jogi na tayo says to my yoi to eat the runoni. Like I have said, you need not be so straight laced, at, but all the time it is quite troubling. He, and it really was him. Got Damn it! Addressed Sakurai with the same old unreliability, broad smile, and gentle tone I had come to know him for, acting as her superior. Unreliability, unreliability. <laughs> I felt sick as the pain in my stomach had been reinvigorated by another kind of agony. Would I? Really have to fight him, and if that wasn't enough, まあここはあなたの理解を得られただけでもよしとしておきましょうか、藤井さん。Well, gaining your understanding is more than a, more than acceptable at this stage, Mister Fuji. それで聞いていると思いますが、私はあなたにお会いして。このように語り合う場を持ちたかった。その内容は他でもない。我々共通の隣人について。Hmm. 
I believe this shall come as no surprise, but I have desired an opportunity to, to discuss a certain topic with you, about someone we both know very well. Yes, I do. I would appreciate an honest answer. Do you love Theresia? I do. I love that child, although I don't really got to meet her all that much. But I do love her. Nani? What? She was someone I needed desperately with a... I needed desperately to know more about... I can't read today, I'm sorry. Yet wanted to avoid bringing up at all costs. Theresia, in other words, Imura. I... Dato. Did you say... Love? Eh. あなた方の仲がいいのは知っています。友人とも、あるいはそれ以上とも、お互いに苦からず思い合っているのでしょう。ならば、個人的に興味が尽きない。I get along quite well. The two of you consider the other a friend, or perhaps something more? If so, I'm very much interested to hear the truth. Anata, Taigi ya meibun ga tateba, Theresia sae korosu tsumori de iru no desu ka? Oh no, don't, don't tell me that she's like your vessel, and she needs to be alive for you to be on this planet in this reality i don't know and ren would need to kill her to kill trifa please don't tell me it's something like that would you kill even theresia in the name of justice and moral duty <laughs> i あなたは私を憎みつつある。殺す大義を見つけつつある。ええ、そうですよ。あなたは正しい。私は外しか及ぼしません。少なくともあなたにはね。You are starting to burn with hatred towards me, looking for a reason to end my life. Ah, indeed, you are correct. I would be nothing but a menace, at least to you. Naraba kekko, teki, snawachi gekimetsu subeshi. Sono shigoku kantan na kooshiki o, anata wa kanojo ni mo atehame masu ka? That is quite fine. Enemies should be annihilated, as well as uh, as we all know. Does that remarkably simple equation? However, apply to her as well. Why would it? If you if you tell me why I should consider killing her or considering her my enemy, I would love to know, because as far as I know, she doesn't have any powers that can get in my way so why would i kill her すでに殺人には手を染めたでしょう経験者として言いますが一人殺せば止まりませんよ。your hands are already stained with blood i speak from experience but once you murder one there is no end to the killing. To imas. Ima kotae nasai. Anata wa ano Theresia o korosanai no ka korosu no ka. Shh. 
sorry if my aunt yawn didn't want to end, but oh my god. Why? And so I ask again. And you must answer true. Do you love Theresia or not? Are you willing to spill her blood? I still crouched and crawling at the asphalt. I looked up and bellowed with anger. I was an idiot, a fool, an imbecile, a brat, and an incompetent kid who didn't know a goddamn thing. I wasn't even sure if I'd live to the end of this and I'd be tr full of myself. To think I could protect and save someone. Yet even now, I remember those days. And Himuro was naturally part of the day-to-day -day life I meant to reclaim. I wasn't gonna listen to anyone grouping her together with these freaks. I will never lose to you bastards. No matter what happens, killing her is something that I... There was only one thing I could say. Will never do, can't even consider. Huh. Well, thanks for giving me that option. Um, <coughs> voice work, please. Thank you. <sighs> Can't even consider. Well, never do. Will never do is yes, right. Can't even consider in this with this wording. It sounds more like we couldn't face it if we had to, but we would do it. Will never do, yes. I don't know. <laughs> Why are you doing this to me, game? Why? <sighs> I, I will never kill her. Will never do like hell. I do it, you dumbass. Right after I declared that. <laughs> <laughs> Father Trefer broke out into a maddened cackle, his body shaken and twisted with each new fit of laughter. <laughs> I see, I understand. Is that so? Well, well, such. Bravery. <laughs> claim not to lose. You say you will win against me. Against us. You? <laughs> you defeat us with love burning in your heart. <laughs> so
such dazzling resolve. Utsukushiku, urayamashiku, netamashiku, orokashi. Jitsuni, jitsuni, jitsuni shiko. Sasuga wa sasuga. Fukushuri o kakka wa ai mo kawarazu kyo shite oraleru. Beautiful, enviable, resentable, pitiable. How truly, utterly, thoroughly sublime, as ever, the mind of His Excellency, the Vice Commander, is fraught with lunacy. Ah, よくわかりましたよ。理解しました。それがあなたで偽りないと。ではではならば、彼の言葉をお聞きになりましたか？我が主。Ah, I understood. Indeed, I have. You tell the truth without a shred of falsity to taint it. Very well. I know there is nothing false about you. Very well. Have his words reach your ears, my lord and master. For a moment, I felt captivated by Father Trefer's madness, but at the same time, I came to realize something. <laughs> Hello, Golden Beast. In other words, who the abnormal gaze I'd been feeling on my skin these past few minutes belonged to? <laughs> Zaratustra, this is you. Hydri, he killed. Ah, that's why he is called the Divine Vessel. He can, you know, um, be the vessel for the soul of the Golden Beast. That's why. All right. Got it. I hope you got it too with my um, very bad explanation. Yeah, the boy here is Zarathustra, Lord Heydrich, <laughs> the substitute of your sworn friend. The moment he uttered that word, the very canopy of the heavens appeared to tremble in response. Yeah. <laughs> An overwhelming pressure seized me, threatening to crush my very bones, almost like the skies themselves had fallen. I found myself pinned to the ground, unable to move as cracks ran through the asphalt around me. The bridge and the seas below howled, thousands of tons of steel and concrete rent asunder by the very presence of a certain So, Chukuna Gokan saw what has Nestakarimas, eh? Do this. What do you think? Let me hear your honest impressions. What could I? Adequate. Only for the truth of remain detached from the pressure rav ravaging Sakurai and me, a voice echoed from above him. <laughs> A grand whirlpool of gold, or perhaps a hole? Yeah. Yay! We get to see him again! It's been a while. Hydrate <laughs> You're already done? Oh, okay. To claim he shall emerge victorious against the obsidian round table, against me, an admirable display of resolve, a soul worth clashing against. Hey, <laughs> The projection began to take form before my eyes, assuming the shape of a man. A man of such tall stature. Uh, I'd probably have to look high up to see him, even if I was standing. His physique appeared quite proportionate as well, 
almost like it represented the golden mean of the human body. His golden locks, like a terrible mane behind him, dancing wildly in the night air. His features, beautiful enough to drive one to suicide. His physical build, exhibited. No flaws whatsoever. <laughs> Um, I'm, I'm stuck at this feature is beautiful enough to drive one to suicide? What? What? Why would you kill yourself over beauty? Um, yeah, okay. His narrow slits revealed a pair of golden eyes gazing calmly upon the world below. The glimmer, the light of hellfire. I had no doubt in my mind that this guy this was those bastards allow me to introduce myself my beloved offering my name is reinhardt reinhardt i'm sorry i said i would pronounce these names German, so I will do that. I quickly recalled that there was a man by the name known as the Tortenkopf's Black Prince and the Hangman. Why use one, one German word and the rest in English? Why? The skulls, the skull of the Black Prince. No, the skulls Black Prince would be what is written here. All right, and I see that I'm actually all out of time, but I want to get to this. <gasps> uh -huh. Well, I guess we'll have to get to this in the next part. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed it and like where this is heading. Although I don't know which ride we're on right now. If we are, no, we haven't finished chapter 6 yet, so we are on no route yet. We're still on the common route. So, yeah, in the common part, whatever, whatever you want to call it. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. Bye!